I like whipped cream. And, uh... Too easy. We should, too easy. This was too easy, yeah. It's not easy for you. <laughs> We're out of time. Yeah. Well, well, we're just going to have to cut something out of the middle. <laughs> <laughs> On this show, that's not going to be hard to do. <laughs> yeah, she's a pretty lady. She is. She's yeah. very nice. Yeah. We're talking about Marla Miller, and she writes for the Coaster in Newport Beach, and she writes a column called Community Chit Chat, and Marla was nice enough to write an article with about... With a picture, yeah. With a picture, with All a picture. Right about at home on the range can you believe this thank you marla miller we just think the world of you and uh it's it's quite a nice article actually all right and in viewer mail melody perry from newport beach writes dear barbara and john oh she got that wrong <laughs> your cooking show is great fun my neighbors are even watching it now after making the dog food guess i'll have to get a dog <laughs> i'm sending you my current tupperware catalog we have lots of terrific containers to store your dog food. It's also great for keeping spiders out of your last week's food. Can I interest you in my flaming cake, cake recipe? Keep up the oh, fun yeah, stuff. Oh, yeah, I, I like flaming. Melody Perry. I like flaming stuff. Melody Perry that. is a Tupperware lady. Uh-oh. And she has sent us a Tupperware catalog. Mm. Isn't that neat? It's terrific. Okay. You know, Barbara, we've got a lot to cook today. We well, should get started. Start it, and well, I will finish yeah, okay, reading viewer okay, mail to okay. you. You can. You, I, um, I got. A, I got a quarter of these potatoes up here. Okay, quarter those potatoes. All right, all right. We also have a very lovely lady, uh, Connie Ponce, who watches us in Dimension Cable, and she wrote, "Dear Barbara, my oh, family wow. and I wish to compliment you on your cooking show <laughs> and let you know how much we enjoy it. We hope you have continued success in producing unique." programs. And I'm another Italian who loves to cook, and I live and work in Laguna Niguel. And we've got an, a fax request for uh, Cornish put these, Game Barbara, I'm going to put these potatoes in the pot over there. Is that all right? Yeah. Just go ahead. Don't let me bother you. All from right. Lori Wilkes in Costa Mesa and from Al Fisher in Newport Beach. He loved our dog food recipe, and that's viewer mail for today. Now, as you've been hurrying around me, what are we cooking today? We're what are we learning how okay. to cook? <laughs> We're going to have a um, veal scallopini. Uh huh. And, uh, oh, I see this is my place over here. Uh, with some uh, baby carrots, potatoes, and uh, we're going to make a, a soup, a cream of mushroom soup. Barbara, where are you going? Well, you're you standing doing? on my cords. Oh, gosh sakes. Are so you, now look right back now? this way. Oh, boy. Gosh, no you would have think after no all what, the time. No wonder we only got 20, only 20 viewers or that kind of action. Well, they're growing. Okay, it's they're getting better. Growing. Now, we want to put the... Oh, did we say what we're cooking? And we're going to have cream of mushroom soup, and then we're going to have a, just kind of an easy dessert. It's a jello chocolate pudding with some whipped cream and a cherry on the top. Looks good, you know, but it's, it's, you know, it's a no-brainer. Okay? okay, we like those no-brainers. Now, we've got to put the carrots on because it takes 20 minutes for the carrots and the potatoes. These are our potatoes. Yeah. Now, slide that over here and... Uh, and put it right on there. Now these carrots, I couldn't get the fresh ones. Ooh, you're gonna burn, you're gonna burn your elbow because that burner's on. All right. Barbara's always careful that we get under this burner because that's where the camera is up there, and well, they can see what's course, going on here. People are watching the show so that they can learn how to cook. I same as me. So. I don't think so. They just haven't got anything else to do. You know, they're just kind of <laughs> killing time. But anyhow, the, I was talking about these carrots. I didn't go to the right market. I went to that other market again. What other market? Because it's, well, I usually go to Gilson's, but I went to that other market, and they had these... Ralph's? Well, I'm not going to say. But anyhow, they didn't have the fresh baby carrots, which you really should have, because uh -huh. these have probably been cut and, and, and peeled and laid around for months, you know, but what can we do? We didn't have I the other one. I think so. Okay. 
Now that the, the vegetables are on, we can move this over to the other burner, I think. Can now. we? Sure. Okay. What else are we going to see? Well, we're going to start the soup now. We're not, what are we doing? We're here. Oh, you know, this is TV. You know, this and this you're reminds sweating. me of the old Milton Berle show, shows where the guy come out here. Wham! Makeup, you know? Okay. Now, what are, we're going to make the soup. Make a soup. Make the soup. That's right here. That's right here. Now, we'll bring this right over here. We'll take this lid off. The water is boiling. Oh, water is boiling now, fiercely. Two, there are two cups of water there. Okay. And you know what, though? I, I think we've lost some. It's boiling. Because away. it's been boiling? Yeah, it's been boiling. So we're going to put a little more in just, you know, you know. Okay. You're such a precise cook. Yeah, I mean, this is what I really love about you. <laughs> we're going to put four spoons of, uh, of um, chicken bouillon in here. Chicken bouillon. Do yeah, you happen one. to know that chicken bouillon has Two. a lot of monosodium glutamate in it? Four. It has what? It has a lot of monosodium glutamate, MSG, in it. Really? Yes, look at the, look at the label. Well, I'll be I on saw it. this thing on 60 Minutes on Really? It. Yes. But it's sure good stuff for cooking, you know? Well, it's a flavor enhancer, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, so... Um, I just thought I'd share that little bit of trivia. Good. That's good to know, because if you have a monosodium, what is it, Mono, monosodium, monosodium glutamate. glutamate deficiency, we're going to fix that up right now and get you, get you going. Okay. This soup is so easy and so good. You see what we do? We got we got two two cups of water and uh, four um, spoons of uh, chicken bouillon. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to put some milk in it. Milk. Some, yes, 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 yes. Are we using low-fat milk? No, no, we're not going to put milk in it. We're going to put half and half cream because this has got a lot of cholesterol and a lot of calories in it. This soup has very good. Okay. Well, I wouldn't want anyone to accuse you of being healthy. This is Knudsen. How do you get into these things? Look at here. Okay. Well, now you're just like destroying that thing. Well, what can you do? This Look. is Knudsen. Now, this is two cups in here. It says is one it pint. pronounced Knudsen? It, it's pronounced Knudsen, yes, because my mother was born in Norway, and I know those things. Okay. Now, so two cups. That's, that's eight ounces is two cups. That's what that is, one pint. Okay. Okay. Now we don't. We we want to just. We don't want that to boil too much. Just come okay, to a boil so and we, we turn it off. Okay. So just stir it slightly. Now, all we do now, and we're going to try this again. I don't know. The I, I hate gadgets, but mushrooms are really sometimes uh, difficult. We got a fly hovering around here. Well, difficult to slice, and these egg slicers are great for slicing mushrooms. They but are. But last time we tried, remember the thing just destroyed. Well, this is a different brand. This is a. So we're going to try that. You used that. an Echo brand last yeah, time. Yeah, well, this is something else. Is it going to work? Okay, that looks like it's Maybe working. Maybe it worked. Didn't go all the way through. No? Looks a little messy. Well, you know what? You thought last time you just bought tough mushrooms. Well, maybe so. But these aren't going all the way through. This is not doing it. I'll tell you, this is doing better than you can do with a knife, though. You know? Because... The, so it's, a, it's just a regular egg. This is working okay. Because, see, the one that's coming through knocks the next one through. All right? Huh? <laughs> Okay. Now we need a cup full of these mushrooms here. Okay. Well, a, little, a cup and a little bit more. A cup and a little bit yeah. more. Boy, that's a big one. Is that going to cut? Yeah. For you people at home that might be hearing airplanes above us. That is an airplane. Listen. That is an airplane. Oh, boy. You know, our, our cooking show set is in John's garage. Which is under the... Under which is the in a flight pattern flight. of John Wayne Airport. <laughs> so... Okay. Now, you know, this looks like about enough mushrooms right here. That looks like about a cup. Yeah, Do you want to measure them? No, we wouldn't. that would be cheating. One more. One more. Because we have to use these in our, uh, our veal scallopini, too. You know, we use some mushrooms. So we're going to leave this, uh, this egg slicer right here. Okay, let's put these in here. All right? They're going in. All right. Now, just stir those around mixture. slowly. Now, don't beat them to death, Barbara. Well, Golly. I'm just oh. stirring. It's so violent. All right. That's looking good. Okay. Now, we just need, we do have a lot of, the, the um, beef bouillon has a lot of salt. It's, I thought this was chicken bouillon. Chicken bouillon, yeah. And it Stay has, with us. All right, chicken bouillon. It has a lot of salt, but it has no pepper. So we have to put a little bit of pepper in there, okay? Do you ever use that pepper mill that I bought you? I lost it. You lost it? I lost it, yeah. How so, can you lose a I pepper mill? I just lost milk? my microphone, too. <laughs> <laughs> You're having a rough time of it. Here, let me get this back all on right. you again. I'll, I'll put some pepper in here while you're doing that, all right? Okay. Okay. Is it all right? Is it right there? No. Oh, that's good, yeah. All right. All right. Now, 
Now this is a trick. Well, you saw me do this, I think, with the uh, with the veal marsala. Well, some people haven't seen it. Yeah. Well, anyhow, we we take this baggie. Not a baggie. It's a it's a ziplock zip -lock bag. A zi in fact, this is a freezer bag because it's a little heavier. But it doesn't have to be a freezer bag. It costs more money. But this happens to be a freezer bag because it's all I had. And now, and then we put the. Uh, and you know what? I bought a real thing. A real pounder. Barbara got Barbara got on my case for using my rubber mallet that I put the tires on the car with to do this last time. So I bought a real aluminum thing here. And we pound this veal out to about twice the size it is. See? And the, can the camera see this? I know they can hear it. Boy, that's crazy. Oh, that's so. Now, don't run off with my bowls. Not right we, don't, we don't have to do this much because, uh, because I've already pounded all this out. I just left two of this to pound out on camera. Good thinking. See, see, Gosh, I'll right. tell you. All right. You're so with it. All right, but that's what these other shows do, and I, I hate it. You know, they got it almost all done, and they just glue it, and it's done. We in five don't. Seconds. I, I don't think anybody's going to want to sit through you pound. Yeah, well, <laughs> sure. Why not? They don't have nothing else to do. I mean, anybody, anybody watching this show can't have much to do. All right. I must say that your hands are looking no. very nice. Oh, I got my nails done over by this nice lady, Pat. Her name is Pat Gilbert. Over here on Bristol, yeah. That's kind of fun to go in there, Thomas you know? J. Salon, that's right. There's almost all pretty girls in that place, you know that? Really? Are you I thought you would like oh, it Oh, I loved there. it. I love it. Okay. Now, we've got this all pounded out. So, uh, now, now you took my bowls. What did you do with my bowls? Well, your bowls are right here. Uh, let's put them back where they belong. Okay. Now, that one's all, all wet. We don't want the wet bowl. Oh, yeah, we don't want to boil that. Too. Is, it, is, it, is it hot? It's hot. Okay. It's steaming. Oh, terrific. That's all done. Let's just put the cover on it and set it off the, off the fire over there. Okay. Anyhow, this is Parmesan. What's the matter here? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Probably from the heat and humidity, it's, uh, it's probably stuck. Yeah, it's very warm, you know? Now, we're going to... This, this, this eel, isn't that gorgeous stuff? Look at that. You can Look almost see through it. it. Yeah, it, it is. It's, it's great. And we're going to dip it in this... Uh, in the Parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese like this. See, coat it with the cheese. Isn't that nice? Isn't that great? Right. And we would stick to this? Yeah. I mean, it doesn't look like it's sticking terribly well, sure. wonderful. Well, you, you can't have a whole lot of it with cake, you know. This is just right. Oh. Four tablespoons yes. of butter. Yeah. Is mm -hmm. that a third? That's a third, yeah. I have to make sure here because you're so particular when it comes to ingredients and recipes. Yeah. You got, you've got to really measure carefully. Yeah, okay. You know, I, my, my great big skillet that's about this big around, I couldn't... I quit Stop it, Barbie. Uh, is, uh, has disappeared. I don't know what happened to Somebody it. Somebody stole your skillet? Yeah, it's a very expensive uh, circular one, too. It's a gorgeous thing. Are we rolling? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Did you so, just take a nap on that's, us? Yeah, that's about right. Okay. That's just a good amount of butter. All okay. Right? Now. So this recipe calls for a good amount of butter. No, it calls for, it says right here, one half cup of melted butter. And that's a half okay. cup we got there. Now, and a quarter cup, cup of, of sliced, sliced mushrooms, mushrooms, which we... And, a, and we got to have some boiling water. Well, we'll take some out of the potatoes, see? That's an okay. old trick, you know, that... Uh, and two tables... Uh, and uh, two tablespoons of bo uh, boiling water, four tablespoons of sherry, and and one, one cup... Wait, well, I got a cup of sliced... Two cups of sliced mushrooms. What's the matter there? Okay. Swish those around in the butter, kind of saute them. You know, this is... yeah. This is great. Look in here. No. Okay. Two tablespoons of boiling water. Now, this is our potatoes. No, that's our carrots. No, that's our carrots. We don't use carrot water because carrots have a very strong... The potatoes, in they don't have any. Oops, wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Two tablespoons of... of uh, Care. Boiling, uh, boiling, boiling water potato today. water. Boiling water. I, now, this is a recipe I got out of a book, and I can't imagine what, the, what the, those two tablespoons of water do. And... Uh, Four tablespoons of sherry. Now, don't get too close to this while it's cooking off. You'll get bombed, Barbara. One, two, three, four. Better put one more in. Looks good. Okay. Huh? One right. for good luck. Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, and then you know what we get in there, too? What? We get some beef bouillon with, with our monosodium, what is it, guys? Monosodium glutamate. 
One teaspoon. Monosodium glutamate. Okay. MSG. That makes it good. All right. Now, push that all around there. Oh, that's looking great. All right. Now. Now, we're going to make our dessert. Okay. While you're doing that. This is some uh, chocolate jello pudding, whatever it is. Comes in a package. Comes in a package. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to put this in here. All right. Now, this is our, our, our bowl for our um, uh, KitchenAid mixer. Yes. And then we're going to put three cups of cold milk. All right. This is a real no-brainer, real quickie. Yeah. That's, that's two. Uh, one more is three. Where is, where is it there? All right, that's three. Close enough. Close enough. Now we're going to put this on the mixer and let it mix for a while. This is going to, you know, we hear, yeah, we'll hear this on our sound thing, won't we? How easy. That's it. And then we have our little, uh, our little dessert dishes that we have to spoon it into when that, uh, when that gets done mixing. So how is our... Uh, our veal is finished. Okay, and well, well, that's happening, good. That's how we're going to uh, drain our carrots. Look at these lovely little carrots. Aren't they great? They're you know, beautiful. They beautiful. Oh, boy. You know, at the fair, I saw a guy eating uh, goldfish. So no I mean, way! Yeah, mm -hmm. And I thought, but you know what? It was, a, it, was a, it was a fake, and they were carrots. And here I thought the guy was having some really fresh fish, you know? Oops. This, is, this, this handle is hot. And you know why this handle is hot? No, sir. It's because you had the handle over the burner. And when the handle's over the burner, boy, it gets hot. Of course it had to be my fault. Oh, it was. Ooh. Ah! <laughs> oh, my. Now, that water was hot, wasn't it? <laughs> a little. See, while we're doing this, you know, yes. how, usually when you try to hold a lid on and, and, and drain stuff in the sink, how you burn your fingers and, uh -huh. the, and everything, it just doesn't work. But if you use a, a, a big strainer like this, it just really makes it easy, doesn't it? Those Oops. potatoes look wonderful. Look great, yeah, all right. Great. Now, now oh, we are, uh, we better stop here because this will be, this gets, if, if this goes too long, it gets like cement, you know? It really does, and it's almost like cement now. Oh, this, I'm glad to see you using the spoons I bought you. No, this is, this is, the ones you bought me are still on the boat, Barbara. Oh. Yeah, this is, uh, this, this hardens real quickly. It would be great, like I say, for cement, you know. In fact, if they get cement that would harden that quick, it would be good, you know. Then Should you we refrigerate this? Then you couldn't, uh, it was cold milk. Well, kind of cold milk. Yeah, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put these in the refrigerator. Well, wait a minute, let's finish them up. As long as we're, we're doing, let's, let's get the, um, in the refrigerator is some, uh, no, here it is right here. And I'm not going to let you get close to this. I'm not going to let you get close to this whipped cream because I know what you do with whipped cream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, can you put one, one little cherry on top there? Sure. Good girl. You know, this is a pretty dessert. I mean, and it's not bad, you know, considering it's really a no-brainer. No. Mm. Maraschino cherries, mm -hmm. right on top. Don't you think we should have took the thing off of them? What? No, this way really? you can kind of pick them up. I think they're pretty that okay. way. Well, whatever you say. Now, we don't want to put these in the refrigerator. Let's just, let, well, where should let's we put them? put them out for okay. display. All right, all right. And now, why don't we assemble our dish? Now, for our potatoes, for our potatoes, this is, you know, I got, because I used some, some scallions for chives, one of our viewer mail things I got criticized, but these are genuine real chives I have in my hand here. That's right, you were trying to pass off scallions yeah, for I chives. Got I got caught, I really did. Somebody it? actually oh, cooked boy. knew it. Yeah, yeah. So these are real, uh, real chives, and we're going to put a few of these on our potatoes, okay? Okay. That should be enough, shouldn't it, huh? What do you think? Works. Yeah. 
We don't want that long. You know, my knife is getting dull. I can't it's time to it. sharpen it. Maybe yes. on our next show, you can sharpen a knife and show people okay. how to do it properly. Now, these, these smell just like onions. I don't know what the difference is between the, uh, the uh, uh, scallions and chives, except the scallions are bigger. You know, I think we're almost done. Now, can can you we believe, assemble our dish? Can you believe that we have made soup? And we made a, uh, uh, a whole meal and uh, um, a dessert. I can't believe it. Now, have we got a... No. Well, we'll do it on here. We don't... Well, we'll do it on... We've got one here. Yeah, we don't have a uh, platter. But we normally would take this veal and put it on a nice large platter. You know, and then we'd put the, uh, the sauce over it. Okay? What's in that pot over there? Nothing. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, boy. Doesn't it smell good? Mm, Isn't that wonderful? That is scrumptious. I can't wait to let's, taste let's get it. This. Let's get this organized a little better here. Ooh, and this looks so good. And you know that butter on there? There are so many calories right here, you cannot believe. Oh, boy. I love it. All right. And this is a, what a nice sauce. Look at here. All right. Perfect. If you'd like a copy of this recipe, you can write to us at the address on our screen. Now, we gotta, we're going we're to eat this stuff. And we ought to take some pictures of it before we eat it, don't you think? Uh, I think so. Oh, boy, look at that. Doesn't that look great? That yeah. looks great. All right. Now, does that complete the show? That completes we it. We're now, finished. We've got, a, we've got our, our, our veal scallopini. We've got our baby carrots, our potatoes. Oh, where, where's our soup? Oh. Here, let's put some... We need a we need a tureen for the soup, which we don't have. But so we can see what it looks like, let's just uh, let's just uh, all right. Where's our spoon we had here? I just uh, oh that'll do that'll do yeah almost we we, we need a, we we have a ladle right in back of you hanging on the wall is a, is a soup ladle a real genuine soup ladle and you know this looks a little bit like like clam chowder but it isn't it's a very light cream of mushroom soup. Because with all the other calories we've got here, we don't need, uh, we don't need a heavy soup, do we? Well, another successful recipe. All right. Okay. See yeah. you again this next week. This looks terrific. Week. John, can you see this? John is our cameraman, yeah. He eats all his food. All right. I'm okay. glad someone does. So, so let's get off. You think we have enough for the, for the show? I think so. All right. Okay. See, see you next week. Next week. Bye. Bye. Are you going to put flour in that? Boy, what are we doing?